یعنی هر جا Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your kindness. Thank you for your mercies. Thank you for your forgiveness. Thank you for who you are to us. Thank you for all that you do for us and in us. Be the result and glorified in Jesus' name. Amen. Father, Lord, as we praise and as we worship, we ask that you have your way in us in Jesus' name. Amen. You were good, you were kind. I have never seen your kind. I'm devoted to your praise and forever to your name. You were good, you were kind. I have never seen your kind. I'm devoted to your praise and forever to you. You were love, you were light. You make everything all right. I'm devoted to your praise and forever to you. You are love, you are light. You're the mighty man of war. We are devoted to your praise and forever to your name. So this morning, this one's just give thanks to God for all he has done, for making us be for everything and it uh, had gone with us this week, last week rather. I want to just give God thanks for who he is and for all he has done for us. And I want to give thanks to God because of who, for his namesake, for being a God of war, for being the first and the last, the beginning and the end. Um, so I'll, I'll read Isaiah 40, 44 verse 6 to 8 and then we give thanks from the said um god king of israel your redeemer um god of the angel army says i am first and i am last and everything in between i'm the only god there is who compares with me like it was like a question who compares to me speak up see if you measure up like um Check yourself. It was just like saying, check yourself, check around you, check um, everyone, check your colleagues, check your president, check the nations of the earth, check everyone that was made by him. Who can be compared to me? Speak. See if you measure up from the beginning, who else has always announced what's coming? So what's coming next? It was like it was like a question from him. He was saying, "I am God. I know everything. I know the beginning. I know the end. I know your in between. I know who you are. I know everything that has to do with you. I know the way you laugh. I know the way you talk. I know where you would be in the future." As in, I I wrote the scroll of you. You know, David said, "I come in the scroll of that was written of me, um, to, to um, do your will." Um. Um, God was saying, like, he was just letting us know that I am the first, I'm the last. I am never, I'm in between. I am everything that you you, you want. I am everything that you, you would desire. I am everything. Like, in this earth, there's, there's none to be compared unto me. There's none who can stand a chance against me. There's none who, can, who is like me, who is unto me. There's none who can be measured up to who I am. Like what? What do you think? Are you like? Are you thinking of that age? Are you thinking of okay? Maybe you don't have a child. Are you thinking of your job? Are you thinking of work? Are, what are you thinking of? What do you think can be measured to me? Okay, are you thinking that um, and the headsmen, the politicians are bigger than me? Who who do you think I am? Like you were saying, who can be measured up to me? Who else has always announced what's coming? Who can tell you what's coming? Even the man who saw tomorrow saw in, in part and, and said it in part. He said, who can tell you what is going to happen tomorrow? 
like can you tell even as everyone is here right now can you just say i'm going to um tomorrow i'm going to be a billionaire or tomorrow i'm going to um i'm um i'm going to nobody knows when he or she will die nobody knows like um like yesterday we uh, we lost a lot of people um due to that rain on friday and nobody knew that that was their last day nobody knew that they were not going to stay up to this day so i just want to just um just think about it say, and say yeah, he was just asking uh, from the beginning who else um sorry uh i think i've moved okay was announced who else can who or who else has announced what's coming so what's coming next it's like it's just like saying starbucks today what's coming next See, okay, since you know what's coming, you know the beginning, you know everything, what's coming next? Or peculiar, what's coming next? Since you feel like you know what's coming next. Or Buari, what's coming next? Since President Buari, what's coming next? Since you know what's coming next. It's like asking, since we feel like we know what's coming next, okay, what's coming next? Anybody want to venture, like, do you want to try? Do you want to try? He's saying, do you want to try? Do, do, does anybody want to try to be God? Do you want to try to be God? To tell me what's happening next, what's going to happen next? To tell us what's going to work next? Okay, then he, he said, don't be afraid and don't worry. Haven't I always kept you informed? Told you what was going on? You are my eyewitness. Have you ever come across a God, a real God other than me? There's no rock like me that I know of, lover of emptiness. So I just want to just, uh, I just, as we praise and as, as we give God thanks, I want to just think about it. Think about it. Wait, did you know you were going to be born? Does your parents know you were going to be born at that period? Do you know that, um, okay, some people, like some, some of us that wanted to do law or some other courses, and then we ended up doing something else. Do we know that that was the way for us? A lot of things, I just reflect on your life, just think about yourself, think about everything. And I don't, I want you to just praise God with an open heart this morning and not thinking about what's what's coming, not thinking about um everything and um, that's happening. You know, some, sometimes so all of us will say we we uh, we have everything all planned up and figured out at all, but God um, is always reason that God, uh, man proposed, God opposed. So I just want to just give God things because he's the one who knows everything. He knows the beginning and the end. He knows everything that is in between. He knows you totally. He knows Nigeria. Okay, let's bring it to, the, um, to Nigeria. He knows Nigeria totally. He knows where Nigeria was from. None of us was alive when Nigeria was from. No, nobody knows what happened. We only just we only read history. We don't know the depth and interest of what happened when Nigeria was formed. We only just know what we read in history that uh, was named by Nigeria was named by uh, Lugard and everything. That's all we know. But we don't know in total that okay, this is how what happened. This is what led to it and everything. We don't even know what they did at that time. We don't know what. And our forefathers did at that time what they sacrificed or what gods they they worshipped and everything. We are just here. All we know is our now, our present. So I want to just thank God for being God. And, and I want to just put it, put aside that that bordering, that um whatever is on your mind, whatever is going through your mind. And just want to just praise the name of the Lord because He is great. He is kind. He is merciful. He is gracious. He's a beautiful Father. He's a is the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. The mighty man in battle. Jehovah Nisi He is. Jehovah Shammai He is the great and mighty God. Thank you, Father, for who you are. Thank you for being a great God. Thank you for being a merciful Father. Thank you because you are love. You are kind. Thank you, Jesus, for all that you do. Thank you for keeping us alive and even in this time and this season. Thank you. Lord, for provisions for every one of us. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you because we can even come together in your presence. Thank you, Lord God, because you are great and you are kind. You are a God who knows time, who holds times and seasons in his hands. Thank you, Jesus, for everything that you do for us. Thank you because you're a merciful Father. Thank you for provisions. Thank you for our children. Thank you because you do not you, you do not just leave us all abandoned. You said you will never leave us nor forsake us. Thank you because you are a God who is always there, who is always there in 
in everything, in every time, in every season of our life, you are there. Thank you, Jesus, for relationships. Thank you, Father, for your love. Thank you for our friends. Thank you, Jesus, for our jobs. Thank you, Father, for everything. Thank you for Nigeria as a whole. Thank you because you are doing what no man has seen and no eyes have, oh, no eyes know. Thank you because we do not know everything. You are the first and the last. As you have spoken to us this morning, you are everything. You are in between. You are everything. You know what's coming up. You know who's our, our sorry, our next president is going to be. You know what's what's coming up to Nigeria, but Lord, we, we don't know anything. We only know what you tell us. We see in part and prophesy in part. So Father, we thank you because you are God and none can stand a chance against you. And no matter what whatever men have said, uh, this is going to happen. We still have a, we see know that there's a God somewhere and, and God can make everything possible. So Father, we thank you this morning. We exalt you this morning. We glorify you this morning. Father, we thank you for our churches. We ask Lord, that your, your will be done in our churches. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father, for everything. Thank you, Lord God, for everything. Okay, um, um as we give, I'm um, sorry. When um PI was saying, go back to God and ask God, Father, what's the way forward? What's the way forward for um for what you want me to do in my industry, in my job, my life, and everything? What do you want me to do? So when I saw this, when uh, I was like, okay, husband, what do I, what do we do? And he was like, praise. And I was just like normal praise and then he gave me the scripture so when i went through the scripture other than normal praise he made me to yeah yeah what Pierre was saying god knows everything god knows everything like he knows everything he knows what you would become what you can amount to he knows your capacity he knows everything when you work with god you are ready you are already fulfilled don't this one that he told abraham i am the, your exceedingly great reward and uh, it was it was it really just blown my mind like god is everything so why am i bothering myself why am i thinking of uh, things that i can't like i feel like i cannot attain and why do i need to chase a lot of things whereas i can just go to god and say god what what's the next step what's the next step what's what's the next step okay father um election is coming for nigeria what's the next step for nigeria what's the next step so i just want to just give thanks to god because and stop been bothered. So don't by um worrying, have you solved any problem? Have you amounted to anything? Have you stopped anything? You haven't stopped anything. So God is just saying this morning, trust me, trust me and give thanks to me because you don't know anything. You don't know you don't know anything. I'm sorry for using the word anything, but you don't know anything. You just know what you know. So I just want to thank you. I just want to just bless God because He is God and He's great. He's merciful and He's gracious. Thank you because you're just your sweet Father. You're a good Father. You know how to come. You don't come late. You don't come. You don't come when it's late. You come on time. You come on time every time. You're always on time. Thank you, Lord God. Even though some situation and some some things doesn't sit well with us but father lord we thank you because we know that you're working even though we don't see it you're working even though we don't feel it you're working because you just never stop working thank you because you just never stop working thank you because you're a god who doesn't sleep nor slumber thank you father because you're a great god thank you because when you were stretching the heavens and the earth we were not even there when we were not even there because you formed us later so father we thank you because you know everything about nigeria you know everything about our life you know everything be that resulted and glorified man in the label shahari kezi tada in bahari kezi tada in the hara labo shihada mari koji tada labo shihada Ibrahari kejete dege Ibrahari lelebo shahada inzuti Ibrahari kejete dege Ibrahari lelebo shahada. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you, Jesus. For in Jesus' name, we're giving thanks. Amen. Um, Amen. Sister Bassadi, you have the floor. Is it why is it a bit low? Hello. Yes, please, we can hear you. All right, okay. So I just wanted to be sure we can hear you. Okay, so thank you so much, Dr. Priya. So let's just begin to ask God 
for his presence like never before in all our churches, in the hearts of the vessels he has already proposed to use, that the presence will come so real and evident upon their life, that this today's worship will be so different like never before. Let's begin to ask for the presence of God in every worship center upon the heart of everyone in the name of Jesus. Father, we ask for your presence. We ask for your presence. Upon every heart, upon every worship centers. That men will not just gather. They, are, they experience you in a new dimension in a separate dimension in a way that only you as God can visit them we acknowledge your presence we pray for your presence across our worship place upon every earth upon the vessels oh God they will speak your will and desires they will speak your will and desires in the name of Jesus we will see you in Men we see you like never before. We pray for your presence. We pray for your presence. When you went, it was good. Father, we trust your presence upon the church. Mongo Mascon, Reggae Mascon, the Hebo, like your thank you jesus thank you Father, for the spirit of our churches thank you lord god as you are brooding you brooding man the yellow she created in the case your presence so real men will see you men will experience you men will encounter you Righteousness in the name of Jesus, men and turn into righteousness this morning in the name of Jesus. Lord, that you speak through the pastors, you speak through every one of them in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, in the front and back up and down, they see Jesus. in the mighty name of Jesus, men will not just worship, they will not just gather, they will gather to see you, they will gather and be celebrated and be healed and be delivered and be helped. Men are will be lifted, they will indeed worship God. Men will see your presence, they will feel you, and they will see your goodness. We want your presence across God like never before. I want your presence like never before. Mary in all our churches, in all our place of worship. Mary upon especially upon the heart of every man. Mari uskun de hebo, re ye ye ye, uskun de hebo, re uskun de hebo, re ye ye ye, mari uskun de hebo, maskun de hebo, re ye ye ye, mari uskun de hebo, kantin si ke uskun de hebo, be a commitment to the Father, there will be a different and unique experience. A counter that transforms life, a counter that transforms destinies, a counter that breaks purpose of God upon the heart of men. Mare on the hebel that we pray across every worship, every heart that worship today. We see goodness in our worship. We see your presence, we see your, we see your liberation, we see your life. Mascon the Hebo Regate, Marigate, Mascon the Hebo, Mascon the Hebo Regate, Mascon the Hebo, 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 M
in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we ask for your presence like never before. We ask for your presence like never before, like the day of Pentecost, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus. We do not want anything but your presence over all altars, over our worship centers, over the hearts of every man, that men will indeed see you, that they will indeed see you, they will indeed see you, their heart will be lifted up. Amen. There's a different encounter across every churches today that we cry for. There's a fire on the altar. In the there's a healing that is different. There's a visitation that is unique. The host of heaven visits every worship center and heart, oh God, in a deep, in a depth like never before, in a depth that no one has ever experienced an encounter. We ask, oh God, for your visitation like never before. We will not miss it. Nobody will miss it. Nobody will miss it. The electron makes it the electron makes it the name of Jesus. In the back of the bush, that had a little Every Nigeria, Lord, they encounter you today. They have an encounter with you today in the name of Jesus. They have an encounter with you today in the name of Jesus. We pray them into encounters with you. And they the life of the the same. And they they see you in everything that they say. They see you in everything in the name of Jesus. They come into the front understanding that you are God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you because you are saying what no eyes have seen and what no ears have heard. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you because you are keeping your repeat in my other Thank you because there's a repeat of the churches of Nigeria. Let's thank, yes, God. Let's thank God because He has started the work of revival. He has started in Nigeria. That will be different from Jesus. Prayer Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus, for your revival. Thank you because the revival breaks forth. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you because men we can turn, come to the full understanding of who you are. Thank you because the spirit, your spirit has been poured and shared abroad to every man. Thank you, Jesus, that every man, every child, every human gets to know you in Jesus' name. We thank you for revival that has broken forth over Nigeria. We thank you for revival that has broken forth over your church, over the out your, your church. The house of God, thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Lord God, because your word says you repeat the gates of hell, your the church and the gates of hell will not prevail. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The work of revival you started. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father, for this work of revival. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, Devo Shahari Kesita. May it come to the understanding of who you are in the name of Jesus. May it come to the understanding. Businesses come to the understanding of who you are. Ideas are being given at this season that will transfer the nation, that transform the nation. Ideas are given in the name of Jesus. The rest of the nations are coming to the house of God. Mande Keshiti, Bahari Keshiti. The world I 
Thank you, Jesus, for the revival that has broken for us in our economy, in our governments, in our churches, in our homes, and people. We thank you for your revival. Thank you for the 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 the revival. Thank you for the revival. Thank the revival. Thank you for 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 the revival. How do we pray transformation for the house of God? Five of which is transformation for us. And transformation for the land in the name of Jesus, transformation in the media, transformation for our children in the name of Jesus, that men come to the full brightness of who they are in Christ Jesus. Thank you for your revival. We worship you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Blessed be your name, O oh God. We worship you. We will return rejoicing. We will return dancing. We will return celebrating. We will return worshiping. We will return lifting up our hands. We will return worshiping God. We will return exalting His holy name. We will return giving Him all honor. Mare poskunde hebo reke gege. Maskunde hebo reke gege. Maskunde hebo. Mare poskunde hebo reke gege. Reke maskunde hebo. Thank you, Jesus. Blessed be your name, O God. We worship you. Adoration. Hallelujah. Adoration. Hallelujah. Blessed be your name, O God. For in Jesus' name we are prayed. Amen. 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 Thank you. We, let's let's before we run, let's pray for intercessors for the strength of inter upon upon our intercessors that the Lord will continue to renew our strength everywhere across the world for every intercessors that will not grow, we will not will not lose out, will not drop our weapon. Prayers in the name of Jesus. Mary they will not give up, they will not lose our strength, they will not give up, they will not drop their weapon, they will not be discouraged. They will not, they will not give up. Jesus, wake up, wake up in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Let it be your name, O oh God. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. 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 We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We just return all glory and shout to your holy name. Blessed be your name, O oh God. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. Thank you, everyone, for joining. Um, we don't have um, other prayer calls today till tomorrow. 6 a.m. I pray the Lord will walk with us and journey with us today and even beyond and walk on our hearts and we indeed experience his presence in Jesus' name. Thank you, Mr. Thank you, Sister Pekulia. God bless you. Let's have a pleasant and wonderful worship experience. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you.